around when there's two police around, that's good. Yeah. Okay, I'll start. Okay. So we're here at Cat Hill, Cat Hill campus. That is going to be turned into some fucking luxury houses. And we're uh, assisting the locals who've been protesting here since February. It's mostly pensioners. We came in with uh, some of our friends. Uh, we managed to occupy a building inside and secure it. But there was one security guy out here in the in the yard that was uh, blocking the, the the door, and he told the police. He called the police, and he told the police that he was assaulted. So they illegally evicted our people from inside. And um, there we are. Two arrests were made really heavy-handedly. And and uh, the police are still here the old ladies who are usually running the protest are here as well and Mordecai is coming with the treats what's the next thing I'll yeah cool the people listen to rumors quick quick update which number do you live at sir? which number do you live at? Definitely South by SX 262. Yes, yes, on video. Yes. Yeah, so spread the word. These people will need more help because uh, from tomorrow they will start uh, the building site again, I think. They already poisoned the lake. They already started chopping off trees just without any reason. The trees are disappearing. The, the locals say that they couldn't see the campus from their homes they can see it clearly now there's less and less trees the biggest park is disappearing here and they're very upset so this will grow into a grassroots action we will help them organize Huh? Phoenix? Because I know Pete Phoenix really well. Phoenix, yeah, yeah. Talk to Pete Phoenix about me, he'll tell you, and he'll tell you that I'm happy to facilitate lawful protests, and I'll always yeah, sure, sure, sure. that. Okay, but yeah, he's in India now. So. Yeah, I know, yeah. <laughs> but when it's unlawful, there's not a lot that we can do, okay? So if it's done lawfully, we'll facilitate it. If it's done unlawfully, then the law says we've got to act, and we don't have much choice there. Okay, so if someone gets assaulted in the course of carrying out a trespass, it becomes an aggravated trespass, even if damage is done within that trespass, an aggravated trespass, yeah. okay, then, which then makes it arrestable for everyone involved in that as a group. Okay, you can Google it and have a look at it, and you'll see that I'm right. Okay, the fact is, is that we could arrest every single person that was on those premises at the time for aggravated trespass, including this gentleman here. Well, that would make the news at least, so they, people would know about what's happening. Yeah, absolutely, that's fine. This was inside right? one, three years old child, possible four years old child. Are you the child's gone with, to his mum's house. I safe now. Yeah, the child's gone to his mum's house. Yeah, it's but okay. But to be fair, to be fair, if I was, if I was going to carry out a protest with my children if I was going to carry out a protest I would not bring my children well we encourage people to do it but not like that children. the best are the grannies children and and uh, yeah, disabled people are the best children. because people use their children okay as a shield for them getting arrested okay and it's their, their future now as a reason to not arrest that people well, this is and not the normal that's not nice it's normally I not ever, yeah, I wouldn't ever inflict my views Okay, if they were unlawful or dangerous on my children, okay, I would only I inflict think safety on my right. children. But it's their future. They don't have a future now. That's our yeah, problem. Yeah, they do have a future. Like Not really, a really bad one. Fair, you are being privatized by G4S now. Lincolnshire is already gone. Yeah, we're trying to. Yeah, but it's, as we're said, trying to help. As I said, people aren't unsympathetic to the cause. I know, I know. Okay? Well, we but have to work together to somehow, awful, of course. We haven't, don't have a yeah, those two guys were not really. They were a bit silly. Okay, yeah, yeah. they were over the top. Okay, and they overly aggressive, you know, yeah. and that didn't need to happen. Yeah, we didn't count with that. Okay, and yeah. and and sometimes, you know, as you know, yeah. the people that you do it with sometimes cause issues that are more than they should be, and that's you know that they've done they've caused that problem, unfortunately. All right. Well, we had no Thanks for listening. Take care. Ciao. Okay, you got that, people? Interesting debate here. Yeah, fuck that. We're doing this for our children's future. Ha ha ha. Car Green says the officer caused the problem. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Not sure. I have to. I have to. <laughs>
some more entertainment from Mordecai. The street never realized something not kosher here. We had to summon you by the hopefully not so hard uh, sacrifice of our friends to the victory. That's, uh, what was the fracking action? Barton Moss was the, the last one. Uh, Balcom. The Balcom is. Let's. So, because. <laughs> we will continue. Yeah, they went and solar now. You will have to stay for 24 hours or two months. I doubt it. Someone else. They'll be back tomorrow working, won't they? Yeah, yeah, it doesn't have to be us when the people finally do and something about that, their own neighborhood. Solar planner and not tracking from there. Yeah, Borkum is going solar now. Many people and they just left Barton Moss. It's not bad. <laughs> but it's, it's better if the actual grassroots thing happens and, and people come in and not so yeah, scrappy going people. Uh, in here? Yeah, housing is it? Yeah, yeah luxury homes again. Did you hear the West Hendon thingy that we did two Sorry? days ago? The West Hendon uh, scandal that we did two days ago. And there's a big estate that's going to be demolished and, and people oh, well, are pushed um, off somewhere else. Perry fields. Uh, no, it's, it's next to the Welsh Harp Reservoir, but yeah. there's a big, 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 big estate. Yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, go yeah, but that's way past the sale by day. Uh, yeah, of course. Yeah, but the people there—they're sending them to Luton, to Wimbledon, to whatever, and they're bigger than also yeah, luxury homes. It's like the Graham Park Estate, isn't it? Do you know the Graham Park Estate? No, no, no. No, it's another estate by Hendon Police Training College. Right, right. That's um, being redeveloped, and the houses and buildings there aren't fit for purpose. Yeah. And they're building nice new flats. Well, you know, and it's yeah, but well, we've seen what they build there, and it's a bit different. Yeah, but it's still well, better, better than what they've got, isn't it? Well, not really. The people don't want to leave that area. That's, that's their problem. And they have to go to Luton, Wimbledon, out of London. It's social cleansing. But what we do is usually we, we show Wim them... Wimbledon? Yeah. Wimbledon's in London? Well, that's in London, but that's not where their friends and family are. But they, they scared the hell out of their MP uh, two days ago. But it was children mostly. And uh, gra grandmas and, and pregnant women. And they scared the shit out of the MP. <laughs> He was like crying in the car. Because <laughs> they're not ready for consequences usually. That they want regeneration as well, but not that way. Oh, they want. <laughs> want to radicalize the grandies. Stay safe, mate. Right. See you. New affordable flats, 18%. Yeah, luxury flats. And maybe two social flats. But here in Barnet, uh, every five years they're going to reevaluate. Uh, if you're eligible to your home, which is shit, you have to live in fear for five years. Ah, support. Oh, there is some support. And they've got non-secure tenancy, which is horrible. We are, as squatters, we are much more secure than the tenants. Okay, so I've got eight minutes now. We've gone past five minutes again. Oh, thanks, thanks, Carl. Wow, perfect, perfect. Affordable, yeah. Save Cat Hill! 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 And this is actually the richer part of Barnet. And these people had it. I mean, this was the thing that really made them protest. You know, these, these people don't really protest. Look at these houses. <laughs> There are the common struggles. Uh, save your air. 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 Save cat heel. 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 We've got everything. Uh, it's going on YouTube now. Someone is cutting the evidence. Safe cat here. 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 Would you like a mask? Who doesn't want to be on camera? Put on the mask. Guy folks. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, there's the anonymous flag. <laughs> oh hey. 
Welcome back. This is not over yet. He lost two people, but they were actually kind of drunk. Kind of reckless to come on a demo like that. But, you know, people were desperate. They, they put a call out. And we used what we could. But that still doesn't mean that they have to grab throats and evict people illegally. because this is not over yet we have a I think we have a surprise <laughs> so not all is lost I'll be back shortly to reserve some power because no, nothing is going to happen in front here but but it's going to be fun if we show you what we actually managed to do <laughs> okay yeah stay tuned people we'll be back in like uh, half an hour I think and you see some wonders because it's not just one group that's doing the job here <laughs> thanks guys for the support and uh, we'll do what we can please share share widely the evidence of what happens here and I hope I hope Jeannie gets the message and she can help us with the legal stuff and hopefully this will get into the papers now because they said that they had some kind of uh, um, news coverage but it, it was nothing you know it was just a couple of old ladies standing there and it was boring for them you know who cares about people dying and having no future for their grandchildren but this this will get into the papers yeah okay see you later guys <laughs> your guest Hungarian Occupy Londoners signing out for now and we'll be back shortly Definitely don't thank you, thank you. Keep on the fight. Forget the power. Power to the people. Bye bye.